Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of the Non-Cooperators. We're back playing some more Killing Floor. Uh, and I just need that one more stalker, so hopefully we can get it at this round. Wave. Yes, they are. No, I don't. So, let us see what we can do. Pop goes ahead, oh, pop, 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 pop. Alright, fine, you go ahead and burn your shit over there. I'm gonna... Fuck. I'm gonna go up here and uh, shoot my shit up here. Can't you see I'm reloading? Stop copying me, motherfucker. There we go. Oh, yay, yay! Stalker! Stalker! Whee! No, fuck me! Yay! We're level 3 now! So... Hang on, D does, does the perks happen right now? Okay, so we got like one extra bullet in this, because we had 24, now it's 25. Well, that's not really the biggest improvement that I've actually seen for this fucking gun, which is... I mean, I thought we'd at least get like 28, minimum. But no, just, just one extra bullet in the, in, the, in the clip. It's better than none. It is none! Well, shit. What about this gun? What does this carry? 50 shots. Eh, that's not bad. See, this one, honestly, when it comes to capacity, that's even much better. Alright, so now we're finally level 3. Now let's switch to Berserker. Wait, wait, wait. Oh my god. 12,000 st 1,200 stalkers and a lot of damage to that. Alright, fuck that. I'm just gonna go with Berserker now. Oh, okay, so... I'll be a berserk at the end of this wave. So in the meantime, we're gonna commando it out. Wait, do I ever load faster? Or was that... Wait, hang on. Yeah, might as well, since I gotta... Do... How many... Was it 1,200? Jesus. Yeah, now all the fucking stalkers come out. You know what? Keep coming. I need 1,200 of you fuckers anyway. Alright, so this gun does not seem like it's unlimited. Uh, not unlimited. What am I talking about? Not uh, faster um, uh, reload time. It's definitely powerful. But it's always been powerful. So that's good. Whoops. Wrong gun. Uh, what button? There we go. I, just, I was trying to hit the Q. Don't look at me, buddy. I don't know where they are. I did, did one. There's one's left. That's all I know. Okay. So now we're gonna be doing melee attacks. So I hate it. I fucking hate it. <laughs> I don't want to do your melee. I hate melee. I really do. It's not fun at all whatsoever. It's actually, it's very hard for me to do melee. Oh, let's not all uh, jump off at once and, and, and try to find this last fucker. I know he's probably going to die off faster than we can find him. But I'm an impatient bastard. Besides, I want to roam around and see if I can find anything that will actually benefit me like this. Oh, fuck me. Of course it's this faggot. I'm sorry, this fucker. Damn it, he's floating! No, no, I got him. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. Seriously. No, I, I, I got that big uh, uh, crystal fuck. <sighs> Alright, so I gotta sell all those guns and get... Um, oh, I don't really have to sell guns, I just, but I do need to make room for Berserker. So I, have to, I do need to sell this. And... Uh, Claymore. That's the best... Uh, weapon you could probably get. Well, well uh, you know what I mean. Best thing you could probably get. Everything else is a DLC, which I don't have. The chainsaw is also pretty good, but I think that takes up too much room. So let me get a shotgun. Uh, I watch really prefer getting this one. Oh, I can't get it? Oh, wow. Fuck you. Fine, I'll take this one. Piece of shit. Because there's no fucking room. Run, sword! Problem is, he's so slow with it. And what do I need to do? I need to get 400,000 damage with melee. But what's the benefit? 40 damage, 40% extra melee damage, faster melee attacks, 15% melee movement, 
Uh, 30% damages on blow pile, 10% resistance on all damage, 30% uh, discount of uh, melee weapons, and can't be grabbed by clothes and said time can be extended by killing an enemy while in slow-mo. Okay. Here we go! Demo Knight mode! I don't know, just the Demo Knight had the claymore with the shield, and he kind of like lunges at people, and is like, oh! and just like attacks them. It's like that. It's like, welcome to a bo welcome to the most boringest Let's Play, where we're just going to be doing nothing but melee attacks. Trying to make it as fun as I can, but I'm not making any promises. Motherfucker, you know what I should have actually done? I should have kept my assault rifle and taken out these bitches. Shit, 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 shit. No, these are mine! I, they're mine! I'm chopping them up. I'm. You, you know what? You can have that fucker. Oh, where you go? Oh, well, he's over there. Yeah, you can have that fucker. Oh, speaking of which, shotguns and everything. Let me, uh... <laughs> Peace! Peace! Oh, <laughs> it's so much fucking fun doing that. You gotta be careful doing it, though, because you could launch yourself into, like, somewhere where you don't want to be. So, you gotta, like, really angle it, like, right there, and be like, Fuck you! And I overshot it, damn it. So you gotta be really precise with it. Alright, so... Damn it. Apparently he's got a chainsaw. Because that's supposed to be the chainsaw looking motherfucker! He's angry at me because it's like Claymore fighting chainsaw. And apparently chainsaw wins. In reality, no. That would not... Oh, good job. In reality, no, that would not be it. The chainsaw jams up way too much. I've actually seen it. Like, it, it gets tangled and jammed up into clothing. That's how bad the chainsaws are. So everyone thinks, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the most gruesomest uh, uh, chainsaw ever in the whole entire world. Like, either he's got a custom-made chainsaw that he, that he just made that has got so much torque and velocity, and the chain is actually sharpened down to a fine point where the fucking thing is actually slicing up everything up in its path, then yes, it's terrifying. But if it's a regular conventional chainsaw you get at Home Depot, home, then no, I am not intimidated at all whatsoever. My clothes will stop the chainsaw in its path. That's how bad your chainsaw is. Not threatening at all whatsoever. Uh, Michael Myers will fuck you up any goddamn day of the week. And that's and that's Michael Myers. I mean, if I J Jason Voorhees, oh yeah, he already fucked shit up anyway. Anyway, where are we going? Honestly, we really don't need to go any- well, actually, lo loading up on our, um... Oh, man, loading up on our clay- uh... Shotgun and... Bulletproof vest. That's what we need. Holy crap, I'm go I'm, I'm just gone, like... It's- what time is it? It's like, it's almost one and I'm already tired and that's why I'm, like, completely out of it, so... But we're almost done. Uh, for episode segments wise uh, I'll do this one last round wave and then I'll end the episode and then I'll can then I'll do my last episode for uh, for Halloween which which if you guys are watching this um, the day it comes out Halloween is tomorrow so this is happy Halloween Eve I guess I don't know if you guys actually celebrate Halloween Eve <laughs> Halloween Eve I don't even know that's even a thing so whatever <sighs> Ugh. The next wave. Yes, 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 we know this is the next wave. I, I know that. Ow, my pride. You found all the pieces to unlock at the trader. Fuck. I'll try and see if I can get that gun, guys, for the next next round. But it's not gonna I think it's gonna be kinda be kinda worthless because the next round is gonna be the boss wave. I mean again, I'll try using it, but. I was not gonna make any promises of like what is the benefit of actually having it. But I really should have something for these uh, for these bitches. Shit! There we go. I did not cut him. Did I? Oh damn! He died. He oh he blew up. What was he? What the fuck was he using? You know what the problem is? Is that they go into the explosive uh, um, weapons, but they're not demo. They're not. De I don't think they're demolition. Hang on, is he a demo? A demo? 
No, he was a, um, a sniper. Or support, I don't know what they call it, but whatever. He, um, he was probably using an explosive or, or a grenade and blew himself up. If you're a demolition, you can actually get away with, uh, I think you can get away with, like, blowing yourself up. Because blowing yourself up does not take any, like, doesn't take enough, dam enough damage away to actually cause death. I mean, obviously, I think once you're at level 6, you're pretty much, like, invincible when it comes to, like, explosives. Being like, oh, that shit is just nothing. It's like, not even a sunburn. That's just warm. And I was a little chilly. But it wasn't even enough, you fuckers. It's not enough warmth. God damn, everyone's dropping like flies. And everyone's saying, I'm sorry. If you're goddamn right, you're sorry for sucking. Now, this game is actually really... This game is, is somewhat difficult. Even on, like, easy difficulty, it can be difficult if you're not paying any attention due to the fact that, like, you know, shit like this can happen. You can get cornered, and, like, right now, I'm gonna get killed. Alright, see, right now, I, I gotta... I gotta get the fuck out of here and just start using start using guns and just keep my distance at this point until I can until I can heal up. Toss a grenade over there. Help them out. Get the fuck off, you fucker. Got to the trailer! Um. Alright, I think I, I think I can claim more it out. See, that's what I really want to use. I want to use those uh, uh, flare revolvers, but I can't. It's a DLC, and I'm not really gonna. I'm not the type of person to waste money on DLC that I probably won't even actually use. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the trader, heal up, and everything, and I'm going to continue with this game, which will be the last way for this map next time on. The non-cooperators. Let me just uh, get all that BS and everything. Oh wait, can I get the new weapon? Oh, come on, give Two thousand dollars. Can I sell that? Yes. All right. So I'm gonna use this weapon next time on the non-cooperators. So we'll see you next time. Ah!